Okay, we're back with our Duplicolor Perfect Match. Duplicate the original Ford colors. And they have them in everything, not just Ford or anything. Um, as you remember here, we've done that side. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come in at the far other side and start getting a little bit of a first coat on it. You're not going to get exactly the same result as you would with a spray gun, but you can get truly good results with this paint. As long as you can reach it. Oh man, look at there, I smacked that. Smack that, well it wasn't it, it wasn't. I can't turn fully on this stool. I feel like I'm going to fall. or drag my shirt through it, one or the other. Okay, it's starting to sputter just a little bit, which I am not very keen of the tips that they have on these. They're not as good as the Krylon tips. Krylon has some of the best tips money can buy, I think. And I even went to the store and bought the kind that the tips you add on. Okay, when you get down to a point where you don't have a lot left, save it for something a little bit more up and down, like I've told you. Do what you want, actually. And I'm going to do that, though. See these specs? I hate that! Okay. I'm gonna get a nice coat on all this, and then I will hit the other side. Running short on battery, too, at the same time. So gonna go in and plug this in, and get a nice coat on this side, and then we'll kinda go over the rest. It's really gonna look good though, in comparison to being all chipped up. Beautiful. Okay, talk to you in a little while here. Back at you with some battery. And as you can see, we got a nice shiny finish on this half. And we're gonna do the other half. I haven't done much to it yet. I did the front, as you can tell, but the top is still all scratched up and scuffed. But this should take almost no paint since it has such a nice coat on it. It's also going to go on completely different. So remember that. Or it could definitely change your day. Um, when you're doing it paint over paint, no matter if it's been sanded or not, it's a lot easier to catch runs. Get runs, if you know what I mean. You don't want to get the runs! And with that in mind... Free car! That's right. Free car! This paint sucks! How are you gonna get a good finish with. Jeez!
Sounds like it's got a Fred Flintstone in there, bird pumping it out. And it's taken, that was the third can. There's actually a good amount left in that can. Okay, honestly, that's about the finish I think you're gonna get there. And I'm doing the exact same thing as the other side. I'm gonna put a coat on this. Tab! Yeah, buddy, tab. That's almost as good as a free car. Well, okay, it's not as good as a free car. Okay, you can see right there, I'm gonna zoom up on this and try and multitask. I'm not really getting able to reach this the way I'm wanting to. And the camera is zoomed in too far now. There we go. I like to take the stroke of the whole hood. That's what she said. And just kind of make sure it's a nice, even top to bottom deal to where you don't have any break off points in between. And I'm thinking the way this stuff's spraying, it's gonna be a good thing we got an extra can. Because the extra can could end up not being extra real quick, really soon here. Which was the intent. I touched it a little bit with a can. These cans suck. I'm gonna write them a letter with a receipt. You guys suck. Well, no, they don't. I like their product. Let me take that back. I love this product. I just think your tips suck, guys. Is this a Krylon? I think this is made by Krylon. Duplicolor. No, Duplicolor is its whole, whole own thing. So I'm coming over this thing pretty thick and heavy now. And then we're gonna do the other side the other way. I ain't got much left in this can. Last can is pretty much gonna have to be ready. Ah! It's gonna look good. I'm gonna use that on the front. And I'll kinda touch this up with the last of our last can here. It goes on nicer when it's new. About uh, halfway through you notice a big difference. And a third of the way through, you got problems on the surfaces like this. And my shirt's touching a little, but honestly, it dries so fast, it doesn't really matter that much. Ah, can't get it either. Ask her if she's got tweezers inside. He took my paint with him. He sure did, he ran off with the paint. No, maybe not. Ooh, it's a little dry right here, I don't like that.
And I know I missed this front a little bit by being up higher. Wow, this one's doing pretty good now. I had to say that right as it sputtered. like to get those edges just a little bit extra. Did she have them? She did, huh? Who the heck has beard hair around here? There we go. Okay, now. Look at the, see? It creates a buildup on that thing. I don't like their tips. These cheap Chinese tips. We don't mind Chinese tits around here, but Chinese tips just ain't getting it. Now come on, it's a family show. Really? What kind of family is learning to repaint their car? That's a cool family, actually. Well. It ain't Mickey D's, but I'm loving it, man. This looks good. Couple little areas that I don't like. And I'm gonna try to get a little bit better. But we are pretty much done with the Ford hood. Just a couple minutes away. And it helps to have two people to where somebody else can tell you, hey, your hairy ass dropped a beard hair in it. And you can go, oh crap! Stuff like that, you know? I don't have that on Jay Leno Garage, whatever. He has some cool cars though. And he has some cool floor jacks on one of, the oh man, they were like, Computer controlled? Oh, geez. That was some cool stuff. All the toys, man. These tips do not spray optimum, like I've said many times. And it's leaving me with a dry spot and a trail that I just don't like. But. I believe I'm pretty much done with this truck. And what we got, and what we got. Unless it's for a color match, I'm gonna be always using a gun. Um, I just like the way the gun shoots. Um, color match, if they make it, man, this stuff's hard to beat. And it'll even out a little bit here after a while. But I think I've pretty much got everything. You see anything else, dude? Look at that! This is just absolutely horrible. Okay, one owner car guy, oneownercarguy.com. That is our Ford hood done. And snap a couple pictures. Tell you to check out my website. Lots of cool stuff on there. I don't think it's the same color. I think it's a totally different color now. Totally different color. Trent says, yeah, it matches pretty good. Wait till it dries, he says. You know, it did look a little whiter, huh? Yeah. You know, there's a couple colors of Ford, and one way or the other, the hood's cleaner. Thanks for watching. We'll talk to you. OneOwnerCarGuy.com.